Howdy y'all, I'm Sam Sather, and today we're watching another rugby video, and it's going to be the most brutal red cards of 2023. So let's hop right into it. So the video today is called Rugby's Most Brutal Red Card Incidents of 2023. It's from Rugby Hooligans, that's the channel. The links will be in the description for both the video and the channel. So let's get right into it. So I'm not exactly sure what warrants a red card, but I, I am interested to see. I'm going to guess he can't kick him. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to guess that's... <laughs> no, I can There's no way. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's a little an asshole move. What was that? Can you not? Is it because, uh, can you not stick an... Yeah, that makes sense. Since they don't have pads on or anything like we do in football, you can stick an elbow out in football. But I'm, it does make sense to me. So this is also a learning experience for some of the rules that, and some of the things you can't do. Leaning with the uh, elbow and an arm to the head. That makes sense. So let's, okay. Was it this guy right here? Yeah. I can see why that would be a red card. Definitely intent to injure. Yeah, makes sense. Oh, this ear. What happened? Head to head. Yep. That's a... That is a penalty in American football, too. <laughs> yeah. Want to prevent uh, concussions. Yeah, I can see. Again, head to head. Oh. God, I know what that feels like with a helmet on. I've had a concussion. Or, excuse me, I'm not supposed to use that word. It's a jinx. A C word. I've had a C word. And, uh... Yeah, they're not fun. <laughs> and some of these, it's like, is that intentional or is it just reactions? Like, you're trying to take them down. I don't know if that was intentional or if he was... You can kind of see on his face. I think this is a case of trying to make a move, trying to make a play, and not doing so with well, good form. I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt, at least that it wasn't intentional. But he should get a red card for that. Yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna hurt somebody. Uh, ooh, what, look at his leg. Look at his knee go under him. You can't really see it. Oh, no, oh, here you go. Ooh. That does not sound fun. All right, let's see. Let's see. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, what's going through your mind at this point? I'm serious. What's going through your mind at this point? <laughs> that shit hurts, man. I bet that hurts like a. You get, you get the word. All right, all right. Oh my god! I just watched the biggest hits video right before this. Uh. Either two days ago, I believe, or no, I watched it yesterday. Uh, I, that video went up yesterday too. This, I'm surprised, was not on there. That's oh god. Oh, and you just know, like, God, from a guy who's had a head injury again, from a guy who's had a head injury. Dear Lord, that's gotta hurt. Yep, there's another one. Seems to be a lot of head-to-head -head is what really draws a red card and gets you kicked out. Surprisingly enough, for rugby fans uh, in American football, head-to-head -head does not get you kicked out on the first time. You just get a, uh, it's a big, actually it does. No, what am I? 
I'm so dumb. It does. Don't. Don't listen. That's targeting. I'm thinking of pass interference. Targeting is what they call it. He does you get you kicked out. Don't listen to what I have to say. I've had a few too many head injuries, obviously. Undiagnosed. Other than one. I definitely feel like some like this with this one. I feel like some position battles, like to get your body positioned, just do draw red cards because you're trying to get into the right position and you have to use your head at some points for that so yeah shoulder to the chin man might have lost a tooth it doesn't feel oh thank god they're wearing mouth guards oh my god oh my god oh oh i thought he got oh I thought he got a full knee to the head. He just got like his thigh. I thought he just got a straight up knee to the noggin. Thank God he didn't. Yeah, head to head. That'll do it. That'll do it. Uh, I'm bleeding after. Hmm. Good fake. Oh my god. It's just a lot of head. Like, you don't know the pain of this unless you have actually been, got your bell wrong. And just because us American football players wear helmets does not mean it doesn't hurt. If we can get hit in the head, like if I get hit in the head by a shoulder pad, I don't, I don't think there's a penalty that gets called. Now if a runner gets hit in the head, like a wide receiver, but for us O-line, it doesn't matter. You get your bell rung a lot, and it just, it, it doesn't, it helps a little bit, the helmet, but it helps a surprisingly low amount. Less, a, a low amount compared to what you're thinking. It, there's pads in there, but those pads also smack into you when you get hit, so it's like, ugh. I feel every single head-to-head -head hit. I just can't imagine doing it at full speed without a helmet. Body slam. Right under the neck. Oh. Hey, God. It's, fun fact. This is what they teach you in WWE school. Is that when you're going down like this, you tuck your neck so you don't get a spinal injury or a neck injury. Same thing, kind of. Um, so that's, luckily, this guy does that. There was one incident of a WWE guy that put his neck back and it just... But if you're ever going down like that, tuck your head. Just... Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, when you play a rough sport, you're gonna have some rough... rough moments. Yeah. Oh, this got hurt. Oh lord. And you just see him collapse. Oh. You see that like... He, he might even got whiplash on this. Look at this. Boom. Oh. Buddy, I'm huh? so sorry for that. Boom. Just collapsed. That... Been there. Been there. Definitely been there. What happened to me is I had a linebacker blitz me and we have some hard hitting linebackers and he just, and I play O-line so I'm in a pass set right here and I'm standing still. I don't move. I'm not going towards him because I'm trying to protect the quarterback because it's a pass play. So I'm in a pass set and the linebacker just charges full speed at me and this dude loves to leave his head. Now he's a great player. He's, he's a true freshman, amazing player. He's gonna be really good. He does hit with his head. <laughs> he hits hard. I'll give him that. He hits really hard, and I can't wait to see how he does. But yeah, he, we went head helmet to helmet. I didn't like fall over. I just kind of like, and I didn't even realize I had a C word until I came off, and I was like, ah, oh, my neck hurts, and I'm kind of like foggy. My trainer went, yeah, you're done. Cheers to that. Oh, 
That one looked like it stung. Oh. Oh, man. Yeah. What else, other than like... This is a question for the comments. Uh, what else, other than uh, hitting the neck and head area, like a... Like a... Uh, you know what I mean? Hitting the neck and air, head area. Uh, can you be carded a get a red card for? I actually do want to know that. So let me know. Hmm. The part with that is he might have. That's like a. He almost broke his nose. Yeah, there's a video. Go check out their channel. The, the link will be in the description. Pretty good compilation, I think. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Deuces.